Hello there. Um, I'm Stormy Ent, or as some people know me, Stormy Ent Suicide. A lot of people know what Suicide Girls are. A lot of people have no clue what Suicide Girls are. Uh, basically, I am an alternative model um, on a website called suicidegirls.com. You should totally check it out. Um, other than that, I also do a bunch of other awesome entrepreneurial kind of things. I'm an artist. I paint. I draw. I do wood burning sometimes. I make jewelry. Uh, headbands, garters, lingerie. Um, I'm just like a scatterbrain. I just try to just get a hold of all the creative things and do it. So that's what I kind of do. That's kind of my life. Um, I used to do video blogs on YouTube, but unfortunately I was like 15 at the time, like 14 or 15 or something like that. And people really suck at that age. <laughs> Not only students, but other teachers kind of bullied me into um, deleting a lot of my videos off YouTube and you know when you're when you're that age a lot of that stuff affects you a lot more than it does when you're older so I just didn't want to handle it I switched schools I deleted all the videos at least I think I did I think maybe some of them are still up I have no idea but um yeah so it took a lot for me to decide to come out of the Suicide Girls vlog world which I've been doing video blogs on Suicide Girls for like a couple months now I guess and people, I get some really good responses and it's been really positive so far, but I was absolutely terrified at the thought of like opening myself up to YouTube because there's so many more people and so many more different kinds of people. And I know there's a lot of closed-minded individuals or people who might not agree with my lifestyle and I totally respect that, but I know a lot of people won't respect how I choose to live my life. And being personally attacked, I'm a really sensitive person and obviously with what I do, um, or with like a lot of what I do, it is, you know, pretty taboo. And so even though I grew up with like nudity and sexuality being very accepted and very open in my life, a lot of people just don't have that. So don't, <laughs> don't be an asshole. <laughs> I know I can't really say that. Obviously people are going to be assholes, but you know, if you don't have anything nice to say, just move on and I'm, you know, you just because of what I do with my life um, in no way reflects what my heart is and who I am on the inside. And I know a lot of people that follow me on things like Instagram and Twitter and Facebook and things like that can totally tell you that I'm kind of cool sometimes. Occasionally, I don't know, maybe, maybe I just think I am. I don't know. But yeah. <laughs> So that's about it. Um, that's how I got into YouTube and where I am now. Um, how I got into modeling in general uh, was I was like, I was working at like Payless Shoes and I had this lady come up to me and she was like, what are you doing with your life? Like, what are you doing here? You don't seem like you, you should be working retail. And I was like, mm, good point. So I started kind of trying to do more things to find myself and make myself happy because I just wasn't happy with where I was in my life. And so I shaved this out of my head, that was like five years ago, <laughs> and I've had it short ever since, but shaved this out of my head, um, started doing like really cool things with my makeup again because when I was like 15, 16, I was super punk crazy hair. I got my first tattoo, which is the one on the back of my neck and people made fun of me for it and it was just super shitty. So then I kind of toned it down for a couple of years and um, really lost myself. But then I started to kind of come into my own again. And uh, one of my friends contacted me who was a makeup artist or going through makeup artistry school. And she was like, dude, you should totally model for me. So I did. And then I got kind of passed around from her to all of the rest of her classmates and then different, you know, groups and classes in the school itself. And I did a bunch of different photo shoots for them and it was super fun. And then I made a, an, account, an account on uh, Model Mayhem, which is a very popular website for models, photographers, makeup artists and agencies and that kind of thing to use. And I just kind of started freelancing and I've grown from there. I've been modeling for almost four years now. Um, I've been nude modeling for about two years now. I do so many different kinds of things. I've done fashion, I've done um, like lingerie, I've done runway, I've done uh, fine art nude, I've done print work, I've done like fucking crazy prosthetics makeup demon stuff and like you name it, I've done enough of gore. Like I'm a super huge fan of horror movies and I'm a really big like lover of nature so I do a lot of like fun creative 
forest and fairy and elven themes and like we get really into it and my life is just all about being creative and all about being positive and spreading positivity and love to everyone around me and everyone that I can possibly influence. <laughs> so that's kind of a little introduction about um, me and who I am and what I do and uh, I will be hopefully putting up more videos with different topics because a lot of people give me a lot of topics when I shout it out on Instagram which you can follow me, um, Stormy Ent. Uh, I'm Stormy Ent on Twitter and Facebook as well. Um, but I asked people like, what do you want me to talk about? And there is a lot of different responses. So I'm going to break them down into different videos and I'm going to be posting new videos every Friday or new vlogs every Friday. Um, I'll be telling you a little bit about what's going on in Suicide Girls on the website, what's going on in my personal life, um, what, 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 yeah, projects that are coming up and shit. There's going to be some promo videos and some really cool behind the scenes stuff that I'm going to be posting. So a lot of really neat stuff is coming your way. So subscribe to my channel and if you have anything that you want me to talk about or any suggestions for me let me know and uh, yeah I hope you guys enjoy what I have to show you in the future <laughs>